Okay, ladies, so this is the hair. As you can see, it is very dry, very brittle, and we are going to revamp it. So this is the setup that I have here. I have a little bit of olive oil. I have my silicone mix. Um, I have a little bit of coconut oil too. I'm gonna use a plastic spoon. I need some tongs as well. And then I just have like my towel with my raggedy weave on it for right now. So uh, let's get started. <music> my water boiling on the stove it is nice and bubbling so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add a little bit of olive oil to the pot that's good um, I'm also gonna add some of my coconut oil as well and that's so that it has a little bit more softness to it and it gets well conditioned and then I'm just gonna stir it up here. I know oil and water really don't mix, but for the purposes of getting our hair to be a little bit softer, this is really gonna help it. So I'm gonna let that sit for a few uh, seconds. It's still bubbling. So now I am going to add the silicone mix. Just a tad. I'm gonna stir that up and wait for that to come back to a boil. Looks really cloudy too. So I'm hoping that that's a good thing. We're gonna let that just dissolve up in the water as much as possible. I would wait until all the pieces are dissolved before you put your hair in and make sure it comes back to a nice little boil. All right, so my water is boiling again after I gave it some time to dissolve. So now it is time to add the hair. So here we go. And I like to add just one piece at a time just because I wanna make sure that it gets soaked in there. So I'm gonna use my tongs to make sure that it all just gets in there and gets soaked. just going to keep stirring it and make sure that everything is nice and coated. I'm going to turn my heat down a little bit and then you are going to let that boil for about 10 minutes, no more than 10 minutes. All right, so it's been boiling for about 10 minutes right now. So I'm going to go ahead and turn my heat off and um, it stops boiling, obviously. I'm gonna let it sit for like another five minutes and then I'm going to transfer the hair from the pot to my towel area. So what I'm gonna do now is transfer the hair from my pot to the towel. So I just transferred my pot to my counter just to make it a little bit easier. Have a little burner down there so I don't destroy my granite. Um, but yeah, I figured that would make the process a little bit easier. So I am ready to transfer it.
do now is um, obviously dry it off. I'm gonna comb through it and then I'm gonna go through the process of letting it dry. So I have my hair and uh, my closure all brushed out here. What I typically like to do is I like to just uh, let them air dry. Um, so I'll probably like put this in my room or something and then let it air dry out. But that is pretty much it. Once this hair dries, I'm gonna get it installed and I will let you guys know how it feels. Yeah.